Hello, YouTube. So, uh, before let's um imagine ourselves before this epidemic, right? Pandemic, whatever. Normies used to say like, <laughs> "Just go outside, bro." Like, if you go outside, like the reason you uh, believe in the black pills because you think everything is like 4chan. But if you went outside, you realize things aren't those the way. The 4chan says it is. First of all, I don't like... I don't browse 4chan every day. I don't even browse it every, every week. Um, But I get what they're saying. They think that... Going outside and... You know, having daily social interactions. Things like that. Because they, they, they have this... um uh, Preconceived notion. You know, the stereotype that... We're just... um. People that don't have jobs, that don't go outside or have friends or anything or ever, so you know, interact with other people. Um, that's mostly not true. Um, but I also wanted to add that going outside made me more black pilled. Now, what they're saying is like the 4chan thing is like they, they, the narrative on poll. You know, there's other things that uh, everything's degenerate and that uh, society is crumbling and all that stuff. And the f social fabric is crumbling. The, f the family, was it the family unit and all this stuff? Uh, they say, um, poll. Um, that's like the average opinion over there. If you if you browse poll, you know, it's, you also see stuff about race and things like that. But also like social issues. Um that's usually what they say, but the thing is, you could go your entire life without going to 4chan or poll and have the same exact opinions they do. Because you go, you don't even have to read uh, certain books or watch certain videos to have those same opinions. Because you get the same outlook from actually going outside. I was more blue pilled when I was much more introverted, more than I am now when I was, uh, like the early college days or. Uh, even the so high high school, I had my friends and all, but like, uh, I would say more the early college days, I was the most introverted because all my high school friends left, uh, things like that, right? And I was much more blue pill. I had the same egalitarian world. But when I started actually, when I dropped out of college, got a full time job, and eventually moved out, you know, and then dealt with people every day, dealt with. Uh, you know, going outside, uh, social, you know, going to some social events here and there, hanging out with people, just talking to people, trying to be a normal person, trying to be at least, uh, trying to fit in with the normies. The more I gradually began to hate them, the more I spent time with normies, I didn't end up like, oh, maybe they're not so bad after all. I should have, uh, I should have uh, gone outside more and, and, you know, hung out with the normies and then I would have liked, no, I gradually began to hate them. The more I was forced to uh, do these interactions. And then I, and it's not like forced as in like gun to my head. It's almost like a social pressure to uh, adapt with these people. You know to um, interact and to blend in with people. You know for. It's just the way things are. It's like once you're out there. You, you know what I'm saying right. Um, it's not always bad to hang out with friends. I you know. But you know what I'm saying, right? Like when when you're sometimes it gets exhausting. Like I hang, out, I'm good with with people in small doses. Like you know, a night out, you have your fun. You know, you go see a movie, you go hang out in a restaurant, or uh, hit a you know go you go to a club or something, get a few drinks, or go to a bar and get a few drinks and talk and and you know have some fun. But then it just after a few hours, I'm like, holy shit, this is still going on. And these people want to be here like all night. Jesus Christ. How do you have the energy for that? But whatever. And uh, now fast forward to today. Fast forward. Now I told you before. Uh, picture. You know. It's 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 uh, January or, or December. January 2020. December 2019. Before this shit hit big. Um, now fast forward to today. Now, now we have to stay inside. <laughs> Dude, it's almost like, I don't even know what to call it. 
like bittersweet, I guess. Like now we, the you know, we like to be. Now I can't even go to the store. Now I'm scared to go to the store. I have to get some like cleaning products or whatever. Um, and I have to wear, like probably wear a mask and a hazmat suit. Uh, yeah. So now, now what are normies gonna do? Normies are forced to stay inside and see how we live, see how we originally lived, the needs themselves, whatever, the wages that that like to be inside uh, after they're done waging. Now, wages like me uh, can't go to work because all the jobs are shut down. So, needs, like there's a hierarchy, right? There's like the, the incel needs, the incel wages, and then like the uh, failed normies, you know, and it keeps it keeps going and going. Um, now, needs are like laughing at us wages because they have to, we have to live their life. But now needs don't recognize that wages are going to have to former wages like me are going to have to use the uh, government resources that needs been using. So that pool of resources needs been using are probably going to be threatened because that that's going to go for people that were uh, working and had to file for unemployment. So I don't know what needs are going to do. Are still getting their welfare check or maybe they're getting money from their parents but i don't know there's going to be a lot of chaos regarding the unemployment stuff and uh i don't i don't even know bro i guess i have to be a neat too like i have to i used to make fun of neats uh but now i have to become one uh so i'm gonna put out more content this is a rambling video because i've been going crazy i've been like I'm going crazy right now. I'm going bananas. Nothing matters. My normal schedule, like wake up, go to work, go home, watch some videos, and then like on my days off, I'll put a video or, or do a stream, and then that's usually my life, right? And now it's like, I don't even want to do anything. I'm thinking of doing a stream later where I fucking like get drunk and... Like, just shit on chat for, like, two hours. Oh, my God. Well, I could just chill my balcony for a, for a moment. Because, like, fucking hell, dude. 